Hi, I'm Terry Johnson, one of the co-creators of The Corkles. Today we're here to celebrate Earth Day for April 22nd with two young scientists. What's your name? Abigail. And what grade are you in, Abigail? Second. Second grade. And what's your name? Nora. And what grade are you in, Nora? Uh, Preschool? Preschool, yes, and you're going to be in kindergarten soon, aren't you? Well, we're going to talk about soil today. How would you girls like to eat a big bowl full of soil? Ooh, no, we wouldn't want to eat it, would I we? I would rather want to eat this candy. Do you know that there are more organisms in this spoonful of soil than there are people on Earth? That's a lot of organisms, isn't it? So soil is very important to our plant and animal life. Well, today we're going to make a soil model. We're going to start with our M&Ms to make our first layer. For our purposes today, we're gonna to talk about the four main layers, horizons of soil, because the layers of soil are called, what are they called, Abigail? Um, Hor horizons, that's right. So we're gonna talk about the bottom horizon, which is bedrock, and that's the rocky part of the soil. Live the plants don't grow in the bedrock, so we're gonna pour our bedrock, our M&Ms at the bottom of our cup. Now we need some subsoil and our chocolate pudding is going to be our subsoil. So let's take our chocolate pudding and kind of spoon it out over our bedrock. The subsoil is doesn't have near as many nutrients or minerals in it as the topsoil. It's mainly clay. So there's your subsoil. And we're going to reach over here and get our cookies. Now, our chocolate cookies. Now that, wait a minute. That doesn't look very much like soil, does it? Mm -mm. What can we do to make that look like soil? Ah, I think we should take it and pound it to make it look like the top soil. It takes over 500 years to produce less than one inch of top soil. So top soil is a very, very value over 500 years. Wow. Yeah, that's a long time. So you have it good and squashed up. And look, our subsoil is quite a bit dark, or our topsoil is quite a bit darker than our subsoil. That's because it gets a lot more water and has a lot more nutrients in it. So let's pour our topsoil, our pretend topsoil, our cookies, over our chocolate pudding. Oh, this soil's pretty, looking pretty good, isn't it? It may be, it may be better than the soil we have over there in the pot, we might actually get to eat this. Now our last layer is kind of a crazy name. It's called, does anybody know what that last layer is? The top layer? Anybody remember? It's called litter. Litter, yes. And the litter is the organic material on top of the subsoil. Which is and actually lay. It's things that have been alive, that's right. Yes, which are worms, and worms, can sometimes be bugs. Dead and leaves and tree bark, those would yeah. all be part of organic materials that you would find yeah. in soil. You wanna put some gummy worms on your soil? So, oh, yum, some good worms. And worms are actually very good for soil. If you were to go out and dig up some soil, you would more than likely find a lot of worms live worms in your soil, wouldn't you? Which are actually very good because they're decomposers. All right, now we have our four layers of soil. Let's hold up our cups so they can see. And what layers do we have? We have the bedrock, we have the subsoil, we have the, do you know what the dark layer is called? Uh, the nutrients. Well, it's, it is where most of the nutrients are. It's the topsoil Top and then the litter. Yum! I think we should eat our soil la layer. What do you think? Should we take a bite? Let's try it. 
sure is good, isn't it? I like soil. What a great way to celebrate Earth Day. Check out more of our videos on youtube.com or check us out on our website at quirkles.com. Say goodbye, girls. Bye. 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 Happy Earth Day.